It's the Wallasey Hovercraft. In 1960, British United Airways was formed to operate a passenger service between Rill and Wallasey. A VA-3 Vickers Armstrong craft, 54 feet in length, was built in Southampton. Four years after Britain pioneered the hovercraft, the world's first hovercraft passenger service started from Rill in North Wales to Wallasey on the Wirral. It was intended that the service would involve 12 crossings daily, six each way, mainly at 90 minute intervals, and operate six days of every week. On the morning of July 20th, a large crowd had gathered to see the hovercraft make its first passage of the 17 miles across the waters to Wallasey from Rill. On board were 24 passengers and mail. The world's first mail to be delivered by hovercraft also went aboard the VA-3. The journey on the day expected to take 25 minutes took a little longer than anticipated at 32 before the hovercraft docked at Lee Socom and Wallasey. Having completed its run at an average speed of 28 knots, that's 32 miles per hour. The 15 mile rill to Wallasey trip, which normally takes two hours by road, is a 20 minute hop for VA3. This new vehicle is undoubtedly an important form of transport of the future, and there are plans for a 10,000 ton ocean-going hovercraft travelling at 250 miles an hour within the next 10 years. Leading the world now, Britain's new hovercraft industry should be given one order only, full speed ahead. Thank you.